Hi catsters. In our house, we have a phrase and it is because cat. Basically, that's our answer to the questions like, why have they done that? Why are they doing something so illogical? Why are they doing something so irritating? Like having a fight on our bed at 3 a.m. or somehow selecting the most expensive pair of shoes to throw up on. Because cat. One of the because cat moments that I'm sure you'll all be familiar with is the I've brought home a brand new bed for you so I'm going to sleep anywhere but. I've got five cats so I've experienced this at least five times. I know what it feels like. You spend all this time, all this money trying to find the best, the fluffiest and the most comfortable bed for your cat. You bring it home, they have a sniff, walk away and sleep on top of a rubbish bin, on a log, in a fruit bowl, basically anywhere apart from that bed. And why do they do this? Because cat. So let's check out some ways to get your cat off the floor, out of the shopping bag and into the beds you've bought them. Of course, I don't know why they would ever object to getting into these beds. I find them quite comfortable. So step one, don't start with your end game. Don't put them exactly where you want them to end up and don't make it like it's not their idea. That is never gonna work when it comes to a cat. You can start in a slightly different location, but once again, you can't make it your idea. They have to get into that bed of their own volition. So when it came to clutch, I thought, I'll put some nice clean washing on the bed. Cyril loves to inconvenience me. If I'm working, he has to be there. So I thought I'll trick him. I'll put the bed in a really inconvenient location. And what do you know? Perfect. He thinks he's being a pain and lying down in front of me so I can't work, but actually he's fallen for my trap. I'm just going to uh, casually and slowly shimmy that bed to the side and hopefully he will accept this new comfy bed. I think we'll call that success, but we haven't finished yet. Now Clutch managed to sneak into his little bed without me noticing, but he now loves it. And back here in the office, voila, we've got what looks to be the start of my crazy cat lady organizational system. <laughs> we've got some happy cats in their beds and I've got a nice tidy office.